Welcome to the seventh tutorial on equality in Islam. We'll look at what social justice is, Muslim teachings about it, case studies and situation ethics. Social justice means restoring equality plus human rights to those in need. The UN and governments have tried to tackle the problem of global poverty. In 2012 the UK government started social justice transforming lives in response to unemployment and poverty. The problem of poverty is getting worse in the UK though, with more people relying on food banks now than ever before. There's a huge gap between rich and poor. The richest 1% have more money collectively than the poorest 55%. Equality is very important in Islam. Since the time of Adam and Hawa, Allah wanted everyone to have access to food, drink, clothing and shelter. Muslims believe they have responsibility to ensure everyone has the most basic needs met. Muslims don't believe in making poor people dependent on the rich, but helping them become self-sufficient. Zakah is one of the five pillars which is used to spread the wealth across the community. Muslims repeat this prayer of Musa. It asks Allah for material and spiritual blessings. Muslims who remember Allah and pay Zakah will receive Allah's mercy. It isn't wrong for a Muslim to be wealthy as long as they share their wealth with those in need. Social justice is not just about wealth. It's making sure that people have a roof over their heads and equal access to education, health services and employment. Malala stood up for the rights of girls in Pakistan. They were being denied an education by the Taliban and she spoke out against it. They shot her as a consequence but this didn't stop her. She won a Nobel Peace Prize and continues to fight for equality. Can you remember what agape love is? Situation ethics means that a person should look to do the most loving thing in every situation based on teachings of Isa. He taught agape love, the idea that we should show love to all people. Muslims believe Prophet Muhammad taught the same thing. In the exam you might be asked to explain Muslim teachings about social justice, as well as arguing for and against whether Muslims have responsibility to do more to support social justice. In summary, millions of people in the UK and around the world are living in poverty because wealth isn't evenly distributed. Muslims believe poverty can be ended by giving zakah.